The title for America's Dairyland may go to Wisconsin, but North Carolina has its own scrumptious chunk of the cheese making market. People from all 50 states have fallen for the cheese made inside a factory in West Jefferson. Fry and Mims gives us a slice of this small town landmark with a big taste. It's a little steamy in this room. In here, you fill a stainless steel vat with 20,000 pounds of raw milk. Add heat to it, throw in some lactic acid, and watch the milk thicken and curdle. Separate the curds, the rubbery, fatty stuff there, from the whey, the watery stuff. Then press the curds together really, really hard in these metal wheels and say cheese. 10 pounds of milk to make one pound of bright orange satisfaction. And that's the way you slice it here at the Ash County Cheese Factory in West Jefferson, a town ringed by mountains and where three massive milk cows stand on East Main Street like sentries. Josh Williams is factory co-owner and manager of the store across the street. The fact that there's a cheese factory here uh, kind of surprises people and it, it uh, gives them something to do. Uh, we offer, of course, the viewing room where people can come watch the process and then uh, you know, come over and, and buy the cheeses that we make and sample them. The cheese factory opened on this spot in 1930 when the Kraft Corporation consolidated several small cheese plants in the area. Kraft ran the factory until 1975, but it's still churning out some of the choicest cheese anywhere. There's no other cheese factories in North or South Carolina that are that are actual factories. There are farms that craft their own cheese, yes, but there's not a full-on factory where you can look out from a viewing room over four vast vats of milk being steamed, stiffened, and stirred. In here, 35 to 40,000 pounds of cheese are cranked out every week. Our cheese is natural cheese. It's, uh, there's no additives uh, to it. And, and what makes a good quality cheese is good, good milk. And I, I believe our milk that we get is, is really good milk. Local milk, he says, from local cows. It's that localness that has lured customers from across the country and from other countries. But among some of the locals, it's still theirs to discover. Megan McLaughlin lives in nearby Zionville. Yeah, as soon as my mom and I walked in the door, we knew we were going to be spending some money here. Um, <laughs> we like to go for the cheese curds. We're big fans of cheese curds. Ah, the cheese curds. They're the store's biggest sellers. The curds are salted and scooped straight out of the vat, and then they're bagged up so people can snap them right up. Really salty, kind of a rubbery, uh, a lot of people call it squeaky cheese because it squeaks when you eat it. Josh Williams says the factory's primary product, as in 98% of what it makes, is good old fashioned hoop cheese pressed in these round molds and sealed in red wax. Uh, it's a really mild, uh, kind of creamy um, cheddar cheese. If you're choosier about your cheese, the store is stacked with an assortment of flavors. Tomato and basil, garlic and parsley, Cajun cheddar, mountain cheddar, mountain cheddar extra sharp, jalapeno pepper. I love it. I love it. I, I love little shops where they have different varieties. I was kind of coming here expecting it to be much smaller with just cheese, but I love walking in here and seeing all the different variety. And it's different, she says, than your garden variety, big box, big name grocery store cheese. There's not really a comparison. I think when you come to places like this to look for cheese, it's a whole different intention. Um, I think if you enjoy cheese, you come to a place like this. Going to a grocery store, it's just to make sandwiches for kids' lunches. You know, it's not really the same thing at all. And I see you are loading up on cheese. What's your favorite kind here? Uh, I like the super sharp, but I like it all, really. I have different varieties, medium, and um, we, get, we get it for our kids as well, and we take it to them, and they all have grown up on Ash County cheese, and they love it. Blue cheese, white cheese, orange cheese, cheese in gift baskets, cheese in bags. In here, you can see the stuff that cheese is made of. Milky, creamy stuff, good stuff. For North Carolina Weekend, I'm Brian Mims. Ash County Cheese is at 106 East Main Street in West Jefferson, and their cheese shop is open Monday through Saturday. To see the cheese actually being made, check out their website at ashcountycheese.com or call ahead at 800-445-1378.